This is the fourth phase of the APEC recovery and asset disposal exercise. According to the finance minister, he says proper procedures are followed by the APEC asset disposal team. Abel says as much as possible, the disposal process is transparent and fair with priority to organizations that dig deep to assist the government deliver services. And so today we are going to complete the dealing with the donated assets, as Secretary has explained. And once again, we thank the Japanese government and Chinese government. They're the ones um, who have given these assets and they've asked that we on-donate them to the relevant agency. Japan and China were acknowledged for their kind gestures in donating over 50 buses, vans and fire trucks, among others. More than 150 vehicles remain, while some remain unaccounted for, while others have minimal damage. And I want to emphasize that this process um, has it adhered to that. We are trying to manage the disposal of public assets according to law. And so there's a process on the Public Finance Management Act and the National Procurement Act, the National Procurement Commission, that um, is handling this. Churches and NGOs were the recipients in this morning's presentation. Finance Secretary Dr. Ken Nangan says other institutions will be presented their vehicles in the coming weeks. We'll be providing a full report through our minister, through the National Executive Council, through the NPC board, and through other oversight agencies like the uh, Ombudsman Commission. So everyone, the general public, everyone will uh, get a fair idea of how we have disposed of the uh, public assets that were purchased for the purposes of APEC. Meanwhile, the finance minister says the next phase is tendering of assets bought by the state. We need to recover the um, a minimal amount of money that the state has spent on these vehicles. And they will come back into consolidated revenue and then contribute to our budget and so forth. It's a very important exercise. Jack Lepava, Jr., National MTV News.